2012 to me, uh, to me, they said it's democracy day. But I think they dedicated it for the late Abiola because of what happened when Abiola died. So I don't really. I don't really think U12 is supposed to be a special day in Nigeria, but likewise they say they dedicated to Abiola, to honor the late children to Abiola. It's just to commemorate democracy as uh, the material MK Abiola decided to lay down his life. Exactly that U12 it's up to 13 years exactly. In June 12th, to the best of my knowledge, it used to be Enki Rabiola Day, and I believe it still is. But it's a day that's been chosen by the federal government of Nigeria to celebrate democracy day. So it marks the, the date of the democracy starting in Nigeria. And it symbolizes the struggle and everything that will come through and we are here now. Turning over from the military to the I mean, so the other side of the regime. But the thing is, June 12th has to tell us a lot about what we have been facing. We don't need to do it. We don't need to, we don't need to control this country to do what they have there, which is the military regime. We need to take it back to the government, government of who we can talk to, walk into the chairman's office, walk into the government's office, ask them what we want, tell them what we want. But during the military regime, you can't just walk into the office and tell them that this is what you want. The following day, is that you find yourself in the barrack or you might have been gone down? The day to remember MKV, Adriola. It's election. He won the election, it's true that he won the election. But according to the law of the, of the country and the, the game on politics, did not. Did not, they did not give him to the, the post. On the line, he let her delete. So we used to remember him. So that anytime we see such kind of situation, we have to know that this is the way the country is. I pray God will adhere to our country and be Nigeria. Yes, we will remember all of those people that are fighting for the democracy now. That's it. You know, some people are fighting for the democracy, for the democracy can be uh, conceded.